This is a vlog. What's up, macaronis? How are you going today? I hope you're doing amazingly. Um, this vlog is going to be a little bit late because I'm doing it right now, and right now is Sunday. But I've also been doing it the other days, and um, what normally takes me eight hours has taken me about four days. I have had no energy, but we're gonna do it. And today I've got a treat for you. I have prepared myself a culinary delight. We've got our iced long black coffee and a, an assortment of ushis. So grab a snack, sit down, and let's mukbang. Screw! This is Glow in the Dark Yoda. I have two of these. Uh, mm. You know, I really like the chewiness of his head. It's a uh, Quite bouncy. Chew or chew not. There is no try. This is a chunky R2 day too. This guy looks like he is gonna be tasty. <laughs> Who else have I got here? This guy isn't Star Wars, but here is Woody. See him? You're in my computer right now, so uh, I guess you're always in my computer. Do you even exist? Who knows? Haha, <laughs> hee hee. Um mm. This is kind of like mushrooms, and I don't particularly like the texture of mushrooms. His brimmed hat, it's kind of, it's not really a vibe, two out of 10. Probably would not chew again, which is a pretty big thing for me because lately I've just um, been chewing on these bad boys all the time. I, I highly recommend, like not sponsored, but I highly recommend you go to the grocery store and pick some up. Oh yeah, mate. Kylo Ren. Mm hmm. Yeah. This is a delicacy. He has a. <clears throat> let me. Let me show you for real. So, I know you shouldn't use your hands with your food, but uh, he has this little arm and he's kind of like, hey, waving, because he is delicious. A little bit of Darth Vader, spice up your life. Just let's, let's taste the dark side, maybe. Wow. This is screw. All right, my greenies, enough with the Yushis. Although I will stand by the fact that they do be hit different, that true factor. I have been putting on cooking myself a meal for no watch, but probably a few days. And there's only so long you can live off the energy of an ice black coffee. Although we do stand an ice black coffee in this establishment, we're going from Yushis to sushi. Uh, let's just cook some sushi. Macaroni in a pot, that's a wrap. <laughs> Screw. We're cooking the rice. The rice is cooking. Full disclosure, I don't really know how to properly cook rice. Uncle Roger would be ashamed. This isn't the greatest kitchen for filming, but like you can just <laughs> look over my shoulder. Oh. <laughs> yeah, we got some tofu. Just firm tofu, you know what I mean? Let's chop them up like that. That, that seems good. Look at these. Can you see that? This seems like a good sliver. <laughs> All right, fresh ginger. And do the same with the garlic. You can have garlic fingers for maybe four to six years after doing this, but if you actually microplane off your fingertips, it does reduce some of the garlic smell. So if you're into fingering vampires, most important ingredient is sesame oil. Hey my greenies, I've um I've been procrastinating just on the ground. Um, maybe that's a bit too real. <coughs> Alright, woo! Skirt! Alright my greenies, so the rice is cooked. And by cooked, I mean she'll be right. Hang in, just a little squeezy squares of rice wine vinegar, a little bit of salt, rickety fry and a sprinkle of sugar. It's good. Get a container. Here's one I prepared earlier because I'm thinking of this, it's actually rusty and almost as disgusting as my pot. Actually, I'd probably say more disgusting, but we're not going to talk about it. Okay? Uh, I also, I want to put on my oven. Let's just flying. I just, I did just pat the dog. That's disgusting. All right, there it is, bit of soy sauce. Screw! Yeet, diddly, yeet. 
Um, so put that just into the oven, bang it in. It's good. So we're on the ground. It's good to stay grounded, they do say. <laughs> no, I'm fine. But honestly, I'm sorry that you can probably tell that my brain is like a little bit distracted. But really, this is like a diary to me. It's something that I could look back on. Maybe it's funny of you. Maybe it's showing you that life is real. You know, there's nothing wrong with having a Trish Pegs moment on the ground. Have a freak out. It is... I forgot what I was talking about, but did you know that people who have, like, who have even socks and they only have socks that match, you can't trust them. Who are you? The... Just reptilian. That's some reptilian little stuff, my dudes. I mean, even socks? No, they can't even. I don't think I've left a store with matching socks. Pretending is hard sometimes. Pretending everything's fine or that you are normal. I don't think I pretend to be someone else, but I do try and keep it together. But I think it's also fun sometimes to just embrace craziness. I was out running in the rain, dancing to music the other night. Is that manic? Or was my Spotify playlist just... Anyway, what a little therapy moment. wonder if I'll leave this in. <laughs> um, you know, I hope you're doing alright. And if you're not... I don't know, leave a comment. Let's cry in the comments. Um, but seriously, reach out. I'll, I'll try and help you out probably. I mean, it's only my beloved macaronis that watch these, so... At the moment. Or if you're doing something amazing, let me know. One of my favorite things is hype manning, people doing whatever they're passionate about. That is so exciting to me. Um, I think this is too much at the moment. I really do think it is too much. So, do you guys see shadow people too? Yeah, they're not only rude, but like Shadow Daryl will just run. I'm like, don't run in the house, Shadow Daryl. Oh, is that burning? Alright my friends, I don't know where I left this video. It's been still no watch, but it's like 1 a.m. So <laughs> you know what? It's fine. We still haven't eaten, so like I'm ready to make some sushi with you. Um, did we get a little bit dark there? I think maybe we did, but you know what? It doesn't really matter because the world is a circle. And if you think about it, everything is a circle. So, I've got my corrode. Do I wash it? Yeah. Do I peel it? No. Nutrients and also lazy. All right, take off the cucumber skin as in the plastic, because apparently that's how we get them now. The environment's crying, but I guess we'll work for them. I don't know why I'm acting like this is a recipe, because I did just chew plastic toys. <laughs> Uh, it's a good idea to not cut this in towards your hand, but we're out here war dog and knife, so you know we live life on the edge. If you've noticed, um, sushi rolls are often circular. So is the moon, and the moon because you're about a human body is eighty percent water, and your eighty percent water in the moon actually changes the tides, and the tides is water. Then the moon changes you. So also that just means astrology is real and also because the sushi is a circle and so is a drain hole and so life is a drain hole. Um, and then you want to just wet your hands. It's good. Now they're no ushis, but they are sushis. It's good. Thanks for watching. I hope you have a fantastic week, macaronis. Keep eating, stay healthy, wear your mask. Remember, you can do anything you want to do. You're just going to be a little bit trash first. And uh, tweet me at Dan Andrews. Honestly, help me. Free Victoria. Hashtag free Victoria. Peace. Screw it. You could try it. Oh, I thought that rabbit pubes. <laughs> Screw it. Or oh, I guess, does R2D2 have a head? He's bought. Screw it. A Great Depression meal. Is it a little bit difficult? Yes, if you want to do it properly, but if you want to do it slightly trash, it's easy. Screw it. Screw it. I'm fine, don't worry about it.
Scoot.